Recently, a biotech postgraduate student hanged herself by suicide. This story is real and it has happened last week. When we tried to find out the reason in her suicide note, she had written that she could not support her family and uh, her father had met with an accident and he was bedridden. She wanted a job and everywhere, wherever she tried, she was not getting the right job opportunities. Finally, she, was, she got so frustrated that she attempted suicide. She is no more in this world. May her soul rest in peace. But this video is about the solution to this problem. I know this is not the right way to start a video, but I had to tell you the truth that there are many people out there who are getting frustrated and they are not being told the right reasons. So because I am from within the industry, I'm interacting on any normal day with more than I think 10 or 20 startups. As soon as I wake up till the time I go to bed, I talk to so many people in the biotech industry. So I believe it's time to address this problem and tell you the truth. So there is going to be three parts or three essential points which I'm going to tell you today. The first is there are jobs, high paying jobs, good jobs available. But majority of you are not aware. And when you are not aware, you feel there is no job. Now let's give you an example. So we have this WhatsApp job placement training program group. So we have this WhatsApp group where I shared a job. It, it is from a immunology startup in Bangalore. And they're looking for someone with a PhD in uh, immunology with two to three years of experience. So I forwarded this job and I told the members that soldiers, look at this job. I know you are not eligible, but think how can you become eligible and start working in that direction. And the salary which they're giving to a PhD in uh, immunology is 24 lakhs per annum starting salary. So that is two lakh rupees per month, right? And um, it's a very good job. But coming back to the reason why she had to commit suicide is because many of the youngsters are not aware of the opportunities. We all are living in an Instagram generation. We don't have time to watch a video of whatever length we make, like five minutes or 10 minutes. If you can't watch a video for 10 minutes, how would you realize where the things are going wrong and fix it. We judge things in 30 seconds. Most of us are not even looking at the opportunities the right way. We think that we are not eligible, but how do you know you are not eligible? So let's me, let me give you an example. So you saw a job of MSc Bioinformatics with two years of experience. You think that you don't have two years of experience, so you are not applying. But your internship counts as a experience. Your certifications can be counted as experience. Right. Anything you did after your bachelor's or master's outside relevant will be counted as an experience. Right. So don't think that you are not experienced enough. Apply. Okay. Now coming to the second part. Yes, it is true that number of startups in our country is less for biotech. More or less two and a half thousand startups are there. Just in Bangalore, there are thousand startups. Okay. By startups, I mean to say there can be one person, a one scientist and one helper who is working in a shared lab. Okay, and that's kind of a company. And there are companies as big as Biocons, Engine, Merck and uh, Dr. Reddy's and all these big companies. Right. Information about the opportunities, youngsters are taking wrong steps. The second is yes, there are less number of companies in India. Ideally, it should be more than 10,000 startups. And that is my dream. But you see, if all of you are running behind job, if all of you are running behind government job or private sector job, then somebody has to create the job also, right? So somebody among you has to jump into the bio entrepreneurship. So that is the second aspect I wanted to tell you. If you do not start new companies, all these people who are passing out where they will go, right? So you have to start a company. How do you start a company? All of you start thinking that I will become Kiran Majumdar Shah. Kiran Majumdar Shah also started Biocon by selling a simple papain enzyme. 
simple biotech company start with a simple product simple biotech company and once you have achieved success then you go on for the complicated products right so if tomorrow if kiran majumdar shah and biocon goes ahead for a patented drug and tries to create its generic i will not be surprised but as a fresher you say that i will create a generic drug i will be surprised right i am not saying you cannot do but i will be su surprised because you don't have experience of that so first gain the experience of running a company and i will mentor you okay i will mentor you guide you we have created a course also by entrepreneurship if you want to start a biotech company why not do it you don't just create employment you prevent so many suicides like the one which i told you right so the first thing which i said the first point i'll repeat is opportunities are there but you have to become eligible for it and that can happen only if you invest in your career your college kept you busy but they did not give you the right skill set and these companies cannot hire you without the right skill set the cso of a company uh, last week came to me and he said these guys cannot uh, they are msc biotechnology they are they cannot handle a burette and a pipette properly how can i exp expect them to run a hplc or gcms they cannot right so that is where the problem is right next moving on to the third point more companies have to collaborate so i'll give you example so recently we collaborated with a swiss company and that was under the fire project so we have we are now employing people so how it happened is we as biotechnica have some strong skill set which the other company company requires so we collaborated right so they pay us we generate employment more employment for more subscribers of biotechnica and those subscribers are now working for the swiss company right so what basically happened is we could generate employment by collaboration so more companies more startups have to come forward to collaborate and i'm sure c camp dbt uh, dst all these government bodies are also working i biome is working in this direction so that more companies can collaborate because when more companies collaborate more employment opportunities are created okay so these are the three broad reasons now coming to the fourth and final thing if you are feeling that you are not getting job because there are less jobs in the sector you're mistaken it is not true the truth is 70% to 80% jobs are not posted on linkedin or facebook or biotechnica or nokri wherever they're just shared in whatsapp like somebody forwards me because i know that guy he'll say hey shekhar can you are in somebody who who is like this then what happens is i'll just forward it to my group of students and those guys will get placed this is how the cycle continues right why because this is free right even the they don't want to pay uh, linkedin or nokri or biotechnica to post the job so they just just do a whatsapp forward right so these things are there so uh, what i want to highlight here is you have to okay invest in your skill set and many a times you may have the skills like last week i was talking to a girl she has a bsc bioinformatics msc bioinformatics now she has published papers now she's doing uh, her uh, mtech in uh, bioinformatics from iit and she was like what next i should do you don't need to do anything first go and hunt for the job no many a times you're not doing the hunt for the job right way many a times your communication skills are not right so you're not able to communicate to the company cso ceo that you are good right so that is where the problem is and that is why we have the whatsapp job placement training program where i personally groom every student okay and we have monthly weekly meetups online as well as offline and we make sure that you get a job right and i have placed so many candidates in dr reddy's in thermo fisher in um, genotypic in uh, i biome itself then we have um, the swiss company i have placed eight students last week quantum zyme i have placed so these are so many companies where we are uh you know placing students so if you are interested you can always go for the whatsapp job assistance program and yes you don't need to you know suicide or take any such drastic step instead you have to just talk right instead of feeling that you are not getting a job find reason take action find reason take action if nobody is ever ready to help you i will help you okay refer by technica website reach out to me at shekhar@biotechnica.org if you are interested for a personalized career counseling session i'll give you that and if you are a part of our uh, you know student group then obviously you can always reach out to me on whatsapp also so these are the things i wanted to share in this video you know dreams will only come become reality unless we take the right steps so with these thoughts thank you so much for watching i'll see you soon in the next one and keep shining bye bye